Just a very quick tip uh, forward slash technique to have safe conversations because oftentimes what happens is the conversations that are had, especially after uh, broken trust or trying to repair a broken marriage, rebuilding or reconciling, is um, conversations often easily get um, out of hand and you get dysregulated and so forth. So one of the things that I highly recommend to the clients that I work with are, is this. Before you go into a conversation, ask your partner, um, what do you need to feel safe during this conversation? And they might say, listen, when you say something and you're done, I need to hear you say, I love you. Or, you know, after you make your point, can you, you know, hold my hand? Or can you hold my hand during this discussion? Or um, whatever the case is, the only way you're going to get through a um, rebuilding process is to have intense conversations. Those intense conversations have to be um, vulnerable because you have to bring your true, authentic, sincere self to the table. And the only way to bring your true, authentic, sincere self to the table is to be able to feel safe. And the only way to feel safe, if your partner doesn't already make you feel safe, is to let them know how. So get into the habit of asking one another, what can I say or do during this conversation to make you feel safe? Remember, if you have to say a safe word to take a pause, please do. I'd rather you guys use a safe word and come back and table the conversation and make sure if you say the safe word, you do come back and table the conversation. I'd much rather you say a safe word 100,000 times than say something disrespecting, um, disparaging, rude, mean, and then you have another mountain you got to climb to heal. So I hope that helps.